find my glasses. Then. Did he do a thumbnail? No, oh. you didn't. That's weird. No thumbnail. Should I do it or does it matter? Yeah, it's not. We're not on yet. Yeah, we are. I mean, people ain't coming in. Is it too I need a thumbnail, no? no. Or should yeah. you? Are you gonna yeah. use it? Do it later on. I I can still do it. I can still change the thumbnail later. You sure? Yeah. Okay now. You want me to? Do it? What time is it? This is what I'm talking about. One fifty four. That's right. Don't forget to put um everything else. Yeah. What is that I was trying to say? Don't forget to put the um on the top the description. I know. In the form of payment. Why is it so dark in here? It's super dark. It's not you. All the lights are. Continue doing what you're doing. Welcome, welcome, Jenny. Welcome. Trying to get myself together. Uh, today is a little better though it's way better today than yesterday it was hot I thought it was like summertime Jenny says hi thank you hello he says hello okay Glasses are super strong. I think I need the other pink ones. I know he's been lazy. I told him, I'm like, aren't you putting in no videos? He has school has been taking all his time. It's all about school. Did you say you haven't been posting no new videos right now? Oh. <laughs> no. He hasn't. I've been giving him ideas, but he doesn't, he doesn't follow through. It's all about school right now. Which is cool. She said she loves your braids. Well, thank you. I did a little bit of Conroe. Yeah, school is important. But I told him he needs a balance. Can't just be school, 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 and no play. I'm like, he got to play a little, Remy. Let me the um, TV is not on. Where's my remote? I got it. No, that's not it. Here. Oh. Did I turn it off? Oh, who's that? Hi, Laura. Welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. I feel like I'm so short. I'm so way down there. I thought you made it shorter. I did. Yeah. Did you want it taller? No. Oh. Okay, that didn't work out. <laughs> okay.
Okay. That actually, St. John Lover kind of wanted to see it. She did email me. So I'm not sure. If she shows up here, I told her I was going to, you know, bring it down. If she, There's two, uh, two little things. Oh, okay, I know which one you see. You see the little baby one. So yeah, that's that's open. It's the other one that's hiding back there. She wanted to see it. But that is only if she's here. Because if she's not here, she snooze, she loses. Oh. The damn fly. My garage is open. I want to open the big garage, but I'm worried about that little lizard. Little baby lizard, lizard. Probably went away. Maybe we can open. <laughs> I know. I think. <laughs> well, if you're watching on your big, are you watching on your big screen? If you're watching on your big screen, you can see. You see it too. You guys are so funny. Well, it's two of them actually. And she was only increasing, she was asking for one. Really, why am I, why can't I play this? Oh, it's, I can do it for you. Oh, you do it both? Yeah, so you can see better. I think I'm going to. Let me turn your chair this way. That's why I put it that way. Because it's blocking my my mannequin. Hi, Sassy. Welcome. Yeah, like, yeah, there you go. Then fix your stuff. That's why I was trying to fix it. So, I don't know how you can make it work. Make it work. Welcome, ladies. Oh my God. You got it? You got it? Okay. You guys ready for fall? Because I am. Yes, guys, thumbs up as you come in, please. Appreciate it, appreciate it. Thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. Rain? Where is it raining? Uh, it ain't raining over here. Jeanine, I was going to go to... Too bad I'm having a live sale. I was going to go to the um, Taste of Soul. 48 degrees? Wow. I wish we had that kind of weather. I want to be cold. Not hot. What's easy bag? Oh, guess what? I forgot to take it. It's actually not a CC bag. It's just a tweed bag that I had used and I put a brooch on it. So let me take out that brooch so it doesn't deceive you guys. I meant to take out the brooch. But I can still show you. You can do the same. You have that brooch. You could tweak it. Hi, the directress 1712. Welcome. Yeah, it's really not a CC bag, but I'll show you. <laughs> oh my goodness. I think, is this, Janine, is this what you are talking about? 
Is this what you guys are talking about? This is not a CC bag, but you can make it one. It's just a tweed bag. It's just a yellow tweed bag that I put the brooch on it. I'm going to take the brooch off, as you can see. It's just a plain old... It's just a plain tweed bag, but see, I could be creative because I have a Chanel bag that looks like this. So I put the brooch on here, but you could take, let me take the brooch out because it's making you all think it's a CC bag, but it's not. I meant to take it off. Voila. This is. Oh, you still going to take it? Oh, okay. Because you do have this. You, did you look in the bag? Because you say you didn't receive it, but, but I have put it in the bag. So let me know. Do you want me to leave this on here? Put it back on? Might as well, because that's how you saw it. So let me save that for you until the life sale begins. Then I'll give you a bell and the price. I'm putting it back on there. Voila. It looked like a Chanel Deville, but I put my own. You can make it straighter. I think I put it a little bit crooked. But how cool is that? Okay. There it is. It's all about the fun, fun, fun. Yeah, we're going to give her a bell when it's when we start because i haven't done the intro i haven't done anything i'm just gonna save it for her janine you know when i work for chanel <laughs> i used to tweak we used to we used to tweak a lot of things coco don't have to design it jackie can or carl didn't have to design it Hi, Deanna Smith. Welcome. Yeah, she said she'll take it, but we'll give her a bell when we start. She will be the first sale. I don't wanna. I don't wanna start selling without doing the intro. So she she just reserved it. But thank you, girl, for for doing that. Okay, let me move this. This camera is annoying. Well, at least today we're not on the teeny screen. Remy figured it out. I'm like, yay, not teeny screen. Make me go crazy. Yeah. Are you guys ready for Halloween? I don't celebrate Halloween. It's not what I do. But if you guys are, to you get your candy or everything? My church is asking for candy. It's like, why? Why are we celebrating Halloween in church? Why are we doing that? <laughs> I mean, I don't know. Yeah, I didn't like I do not do no Halloween. I mean, I used to give her candy, but this year I'm not going to. I feel for my neighborhood kids who come to the to my house. I'm just gonna turn my lights off because I do not buy no candy. Do not feel like doing all that. Um, I don't know. My friend, he said, oh, still do it. I'm like, no, I want to. Because these days, you got big, grown-ass men begging for candy. And you don't know if they're going to come to your house and ambush you. <laughs> you don't know that. <laughs> Last year, I had to tell them, I'm, like, I'm not opening my door. You're too grown to be begging. <laughs> I did not. I was like, go away. So... I mean, there were some big old hefty guys standing there with pillowcases ringing my doorbell. I was like, hell to the no. You ain't coming up in here. I'm not opening my door for you. I don't have no candy. <laughs> oh, that was... So, these days, people are crazy. Yeah, I did it when Remy was younger. I used to take him to the mall. Because Topanga Mall, to me, that was the safest place to beg for candy. I ain't knock nobody's door. Don't know what they put in the candy. So we used to just go from store to store. Yep. The mall was a safe place. Nowadays, we don't even know if the mall is safe. Okay, yeah, that's fine. I'll give it to you. 
It's yours, Judy. We just jibby jabbing about. Oh, I did not do my edges. Oh, hell. I was gonna do my edges and I forgot. Now my big old forehead is just there. Oh, yeah, well, yeah. As long as they go to the right homes, you gotta know where you're going because some of these people are evil. Yeah, the mall was a safe place with, when Remy was a kid. And life was not what it is right now, you know? People were much nicer. They do. Well, that's cool. I mean, kids look forward to it. They do, and I can't blame them for that. But as a parent, these days, day after Halloween, you turn the TV on, and what do you see? Trauma, trauma, trauma. It's like... Ugh. Mommy, are you hot? Uh, I am no. super hot. I'm thinking we should open that big garage door. I think that little lizard is gone. Okay. <laughs> you, I know you're scared. That lizard ain't coming in here. I was trying to open my garage door, but then there was a little baby lizard just looking around. I was like, oh my God, please don't come in here. But I don't think it will. Hi, Vicky. Welcome. You dropped your water. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Open all the way. All the way. Oh, yeah, that feels good. Voila. You scared of a baby lizard? Scared of a baby oh, lizard. Lizard, lizard, lizard. Ooh, yes, that's the Halloween story. How many people in the house, Rams? 24. 24 people. Okay. We almost there. <gasps> Shooks. Yeah, I came um, prepared. I was gonna go. I don't know. We might go tomorrow. I know we can't go today because of the live sale and all. So maybe tomorrow we're thinking about it. Have you been? It's close to your house? Hmm. If we come in, I'll let you know. We get some soul food. All this depends on my husband, because he's the one that drives. Because if he goes like, I don't feel like going, then we ain't going to go. <laughs> but if he's like, sure. Hi, Miss Bossy. Welcome. But I'll let you know. I've never been. My friend keeps trying to invite me, and I'm like, eh. I don't know. I'll be hating crowds, some, too much crowds, but I, I don't know. TBD on that one. Is I'll think about it to be determined. We don't know yet. I know. My lipstick is crooked. So when we get to 30, we're about to start, people. How many people? 27. It's close to your house and you've never been? Really, Jenny? Why? Well, you're not at work now, so what's your excuse? <laughs> Why haven't you been? Let me know. 
I just want to go taste some food. Hi, Cheryl Jennings. Welcome. <laughs> I want to eat, eat. I mean, I keep seeing it on TV and it looks interesting. My crazy friend Donna goes every year. And she keeps saying, you need to come. I'm like, uh, okay. Maybe one day. All right, guys. As we're here, jibby-jabbing, talking, talking, talking. Bottom line is, I don't even know what I'm selling today. I'm just going to be pulling it off as we go along. Mostly handbags because, you know, I stopped. Hi, Tamala. Welcome. I stopped trying to buy clothing for you guys because I'm like, they don't be buying clothing. So why am I even? I mean, except there's something you want to see. If you need a men's blazer, you know I have it. Yeah, they're coming in. We got Hugo Bosses. You know, I got designer. I have luxury. So if there's a men's blazer you're looking for and ask me if I have your size or something, just ask me. <clears throat> and I'm going to go look in my archive and see if it's there and I can pull it out. But bringing it to you guys is like too much. It's like I'm tired of pulling stuff and... Pulling it out of the rack is easy. Putting it back, it becomes a thing. Because those racks are so full. <laughs> I'm like, oh, hell no. I don't make an appointment with the real, real. They are getting on my nerves. They sent me a bag that was broken. Yes, girl. This is the called the Oprah reading glasses. Ha, ha, ha. Thank you. Yes, I brought you, <clears throat> hi, St. John Love, I brought you one, because I know you wanted to see it. So I was telling <clears throat> Janine and Catherine, you had first dibs. If you don't want it, then I guess Janine is second. And if Janine don't want it, then Catherine wants it. <laughs> so I didn't have the time to send you a screenshot. So I'm like, I'm just going to bring it to the live sale and show it to you, so. If you want to hang in there when the sale starts, I will show you. And uh, Remy, how many people? 30. Okay. We have 30 people. Look like my sisters are coming in. I haven't seen Claudette. Is she in? When I don't see some of my sisters, it bothers me because they're here all the time. <laughs> she said. I want to make sure everybody's good. Okay. So welcome guys, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're new here, welcome. Yeah, you've been missing us. Well, I, I didn't have a sale last week. So I've, it's been, you know, some weeks I will have a sale, some week I'm like, eh. So even though this is my happy place, <laughs> it's my, I know everybody got their happy place. It's my happy place. One of my happy places because then I come to talk to my sisters. My handbag closet is my happy place for my zen. So we have I have two happy places. So sometimes I'll be like, oh, if I don't see them on Saturday, I'll see them on Sunday. You know, it is what it is. But yes, this is our happy place. Welcome, 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 welcome. If you're new here, welcome 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 and please join the sisterhood by subscribing because this right here is a sisterhood it's not all about sale 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 it's not all about making money that's not what this is about this is all this is about us coming together and yeah i guess finding some cute stuff and jibby jabbing you know find out how everybody's doing so but to let you guys know i'm doing good i'm strong i'm moving on life is 
life in in a good way oh cool all right guys so if you're new here please subscribe and give me thumbs up as you come in because you are going to enjoy it so i appreciate you for all my sisters my favorite sisters you know who you are you're not new here from another mother and another father but we're still sisters welcome the tra yeah the train gang oh my god that's a good one hi Marcy. welcome is that Marcy miller oh uh, um, yeah. Okay. yeah i hope i pronounced your name correctly it's M -I -C -E is it mickey oh Marcy. either way welcome girl hey k phillips welcome See, some of my sisters are just coming in. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Yes, for all my favorite sisters, welcome. You guys are everything. You guys are everything to me. You guys are my strength. Appreciate you. And I pray for blessings and more blessings and more blessings. Thank you for hanging with your girl. You know, I could be in and out. Today I'm good, tomorrow I'm not, but... You guys are making me strong. All right, guys. So if you're new here, this channel. Oh, guys, I have a question. So you guys know Jet is my initials. Fabulous Jet. And most of you guys refer to me, my real name, which is Jackie. You know, it's what, even though I have a longer name, Jacobine, which is a British name. But Jackie is what I was known ever since I was in school because some people had a hard time pronouncing Jacob and then Vine. It's like the female version of Jacob. Okay, my dad's name was Jacob and they thought I was going to be a, a boy. So they, they were going to name me after my dad. But then I came out, voila, a girl. So they called me Jacob Vine, which means wealth. Anywho, I was thinking... And I need your opinion. Should I change my name to Fabulous Jackie? I don't want YouTube to confuse me or continue to use Jet. What do you all think? Jet is my initial. I don't know. Because everybody's like, hi, Jackie. I'm like, so what's the point of Jet? I mean, I mean, Jet is my YouTube name. I get it. But I'm thinking, should I just say Fabulous Jackie or just leave Jet the way it is? I need you guys to tell me. I don't know if I change it, if YouTube is going to, I'm going to lose some views and people cannot find me. They'll be like, wait a minute, what happened to Fabulous Jet? Well, she's now Fabulous Jackie. I don't know. I'm asking. I want my sisters to let me know. Y'all let me know in the comment section. But anyway, or you could just type it right now as we're talking. See? Okay, one for, one for the road for Fabulous Jackie. It is hard. Well, it's still going to be my name. Fabulous Jackie. Okay, two for the road. And Janine says she don't know either way. Okay. Okay. Makes sense. Which is what you guys call me anyway. You guys call me uh, Jackie. I mean, hardly anybody ever call me Jet. Very few of you guys. All right. Okay. Four for the road. Miss Miller said, Fabulous Jackie. All right. We'll see what YouTube. Remy was like, I don't know if they're going to find you on Fabulous Jackie. Hmm. Okay. All right. Vicky says she agrees with St. John, Fabulous Jet, but you guys still know me as Jackie. Mm hmm. Okay. Okay. You know me. I like to keep it simple. I don't want to confuse anybody. All right, guys, let me know something. It's just food for thought when we think about it. I just want to be personable. Yes, Jet is my initials. Sure is. Ah, oh, that's good. Okay. All right, Diana Smith said, don't break it. If, don't fix it if it's not broken. All right. Okay. Okay. All right, guys. I see you guys don't like change. 
<laughs> Keep it the way it is. Why fix it if it's not broken, huh? Why? All right, that sounds good. <laughs> it's a crop top, girl. Do you want to wear a crop? It's a crop top. I mean, I don't have it, but I can check my lady, see if she has it. It's see, showing my belly button. It's very croppy. So I had to tie something because I didn't want to show my, my belly. All right. Okay. Enough of that. I get the point. It's probably just going to stick. Fabulous Jet. You all just call me Jackie. It's still my name either way. All right. Let me get out of the phone. We're about to start. Mm -hmm. How many people? 35. 35 people in this beautiful train. The train is about to start. As I was saying, welcome to all my newbies. I appreciate you. And I hope you come back. So, if you're wondering what this is all about, I'm sure my sisters are tired of hearing this intro, but I have to say to the new people, welcome, welcome. This is, uh, somebody told, thought this was my boutique itself outside from my house this is a garage boutique this is a boutique <laughs> this is a boutique i don't know if she has any i will double check with her i haven't seen her for a minute i will double check and if, it, if she does i'll bring it to you guys but um this is a garage one part of my garage that i made um I made a boutique. Once upon a time, I owned a boutique. So I needed space during Corona. We closed the boutique down and voila, I started thrifting and you guys gave me ideas to sell. So I converted my garage into a boutique because so, somebody came to my comment, told me to hire a professional to fix my boutique when I said I was cleaning a boutique. I'm like, girl, this is a garage. I ain't finding no professional to come. I've been in retail all my life. I know what to do. I wasn't a, a visual merchandiser, but I know what to do. I know how to put stuff together. But anyway, guys, so yes, this is a garage and everything here, most of it is, uh, some of them is thrifted and some is new from LA showroom, uh, some from the thrift stores that have tags in them. So what we do here in this particular channel, we have a live sale. I have two channels. I have one that's just fabulous jet. It's where I do my personal stuff and my shenanigans. And this is where I do my thrifting and um, live sale. So this is Fabulous Jet 2 live sale. So in case you were confused, there's two of us, but one person. <laughs> two people, but one person, and this is a person. But anyway, so when this is how this works. If I show you an item... And I called a letter or a number. The first person that types the number or the letter is who get the merchandise. And please think before you ask for it because then you're stopping somebody else from getting the merchandise if you're not really sure. We don't do any returns, no exchanges, none of that. Okay? We ain't nostrums. <laughs> I always used to say that because Nostrums used to take back everything. We ain't Nostrums over here, even though they don't take back stuff no more after 30 days. They learned their lesson. All right. So, and uh, we do ship by USPS, which is the post office. And the only reason I use the post office is because your stuff is insured. If the mailman decides to deliver your package to your next door neighbor or some other address and you don't get your merchandise i will go to them they will compensate me and then i'll compensate you but if somebody stole the package out of your patio or mailbox we ain't responsible if the post office said oh it was delivered here blah 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 and they show me proof then we have a situation but i like to ensure your packaging for one item if it's a small, teeny item like earrings or scarf, it's $8. If it's one bag, it used to be $10, but it depends on how bag, big the bag is, from $12 to $14. So if you buy a bag and it's just one, ask me what the shipping is, and I'll tell you. If you get more than one bag, all the way to four is um, $17. 
if you get five items and more is twenty two dollars and these are all priority which means you get it between three to four business days and if you want standard shipping it's going to take you about 10 to 8 business days and it does not come in a priority box and it's not insured so pick and choose what which one you want and with standard shipping i have to take it to the post office and they have to weigh what it is and then i have to email you back and it's like why you want to go through all that priority is safe all right guys we take paypal venmo cash app and zelle and Remy has it on top of the description box. And it's in the description. It's in the description box and on top of the live chat. My email address, if you have any questions, please email me. I will always get back to you. If it takes a minute or two, I will still get back to you because, guys, I do other things. I just don't walk around. I'm not a Gen Z or millennial that walk around with their phone. When I'm done with my phone, I check it somewhere. Then later on, I'll go check it. So if I don't reply you right away, it's not because... I don't want to is because I, my phone is not attached to my hip. I wish it would. Like Mr. Remy here, he, he thinks he's a doctor. He walks around with his phone everywhere he goes. I'm like, are you on call? Tell me some. <laughs> is your patient waiting for you for surgery? <laughs> but anyway, that, that'd be that. So we're about to start the sale. If you have any questions, please, please don't. Just ask me if you see anything in the boutique you want. Ask me like, hey, I see something there. Can you tell me what it is? And I'll take it closer to you and I'll show you. You can tell me if you want it or not. I expect all my payments no later than tomorrow midnight, please. I don't, I ship on Tuesdays. I don't want to wait until Monday and I kept saying, oh my God, this person hasn't paid. I don't want to email you because I feel like that is kind of rude. Like, oh, can you send your payment, please? It's like, no. So just send your payment. Hi, Cheryl Williams. Welcome. And some jibby job in here. So, yes, that's it for the newbies. You have any questions, anybody? Speak now or forever, forever hold thy peace before I start this sale. No, don't hold your peace. Speak up. <laughs> that's what I said. Why am I saying forever hold thy peace? Just tell me. All right. We are going to do handbags today. Okay. <clears throat> if you want to see clothing, let me know. I might show you. I have a couple of, you know, fall is here. I showed you some things way before. You can remind me like, hey, Jackie, did you sell that item you got the other day? Blah, blah, blah. Then I'll let you know. All right. So we're going to start with the bags as I'm talking and talking okay phillips you are okay i mean we're not doing much so you can always go back and rewatch and see what's still around I, i'm really trying to get rid of these bags so because i did bring a few of them in so we are going to start We're going to start with um, numbers. Bag number one goes to Judy Edworth, the um, yellow tweed bag with the brooch, with the CC brooch on there. $40. Judy, do you want it for $40? Okay, sounds good. To the Edwards, forty dollars. I know you reserve it. Yeah, is she there? I'm giving you a bell, Judith. That's to say you want it. Let me know if you don't want it. Say call, call. You know, let me know, and I will put it back move on to the next person so if you want it your bag is ready for you so bag number one goes to judy edwards <clears throat> she say anything hmm? 
two days. Are you around? Didn't hear none from you. Bag number two, St. John Lava. I need for you to let me know if you want this or not. It's a crossbody. Okay, so, yay. All right. St. John Lava is crossbody. It's not a top handle, but you can adjust the strap. It's a FF bag. If you don't want a crossbody, let me know. It'll go to somebody else. $45 for the FF crossbody, St. John Lover. Do we have a delay? No. I'm not. It's just that you, there's a delay when people watch you. Because it's not the same as yours. Oh, like when okay. I watch you, it's different. Okay. So I have like to give him. I have to give him time to reply. Yes. Okay. There she goes. All right. Woohoo! But the the chat is still the same. Okay. Okay. Got it. Got it. Got it. All right. So any. Yes. That was bag number two. Hey, welcome, Life of Deanna. Welcome, welcome. All right. Is there anything else anybody want to see back there before I continue with the pre-love bags? Jeanine, what is it that you saw back there? All right, see, that's the thing. In this channel... We don't go into details on these bags. We just just know it's good. It's good. That's why we don't bring it to the public. It's just all black with a zipper. That's what it looks like. And we don't go into details with those bags. Janine, is there something you want to... Is that what you were looking at back there? Or is there something else you want to see? As I move on to bag number three. It's a junior bag. With crossbody. Okay. Zuni and Berg, bag number three. <clears throat> Let me take out the price tag. It was forty. It was forty-five dollars, people. Even though I, I think I got thirty percent off. So the inside is clean. Bag number three. Bag number three, Zuni and Berg. <laughs> uh, so the Dunian book is fifty dollars in very good condition. Fifty dollars for Duni. Let's just say forty nine. Okay. Forty nine dollars. We're gonna take away that dollar. Very nice. All right. You have to tell me what you... I'm not bringing it to the forefront. Tell me what you're looking for. Bag number... Four. Bag number four. Hold on, guys. I try to make it nice and full. It's a patent leather coach. Black patent leather coach bag. With the zipper. And then it has a back pocket. 
We have the coach emblem. The only thing this bag is missing is a crossbody, which I don't even think you need it because it's such a big old bag. I don't know why you need a crossbody with a big bag. The inside is nice and clean. The coach coach bag is $45. Okay. All right, guys. Remember, I had this vintage bag upstairs, and I realized I'm never going to. I have too many red bags. This beautiful vintage bag by Aspects. It's a, actually, it's a clutch. It's leather with snake skin embossed. It has this big tassel right here. You can use it as a clutch or you can use it as a little bag, but it's giving you the Bottega vibes with a zipper. $30. Oh, that is a Karl Lagerfeld with Chupit in the front. You want to see it? That's a Karl Lagerfeld genuine leather bag. So this is a red clutch, the Bottega beautiful clutch. Look, I mean, Bottega look-alike is $30. The inside is super clean. It has, instead of a snap, it has a zipper that has frills. $30 for a vintage clutch. <clears throat> Bag number. Number six. Bag number six. Beautiful mark by Mark Jacobs. Somebody asked for this bag on, on the comment section. I forgot her name. Is it Nate? But I gave her the price and I didn't hear nothing. Because I had to go to the real real to see how much this bags were selling for. Beautiful pebble grain. Gorgeous bag. These are selling out real fast because Mark Jacobs is about to re do a reissue. And the inside is beautiful, all leather, marked by Mark Jacobs. And this Mark Jacob bag, I mean, I did tell her, I forgot how much I told her, but I'm gonna bring it down today to $70, marked by Mark Jacobs. I think I gave her a little bit too much. I think I had told her maybe 90 or 80. Today is $70, all leather bag. Okay. Oh, some, and she asked for this other bag too. But didn't hear nothing. And um, I don't know if Shoe Diva, Shoe Diva asked for this bag. So I don't know, Shoe Diva, are you around? The metallic coach bag. I did not give it to you because I was... Somebody else has asked for it, but I never got a payment. So it's a metallic coach. She did ask for it, but I told her somebody else had asked for it. Beautiful coach bag, metallic. And the inside is, I think the price, I think I gave her a price of $45. The inside look like this. $45, and then we have a back pocket. Super soft. So if anybody else, if she's not there, anybody else want any of these bags, just type the number in. Number. Number eight. Number eight. It's a Dooney and Burke parachute fabric. Hobo bag. 
with leather trim it's beautiful Zunienberg Jeannie will take the mark back, Mark Jacobs. Mm -hmm. All right. Thank you, Jeannie. For the mark by Mark Jacobs. I was showing you guys this beautiful. Let me show you the inside of the Dunian Burke. Super clean. I have the key key holder. Nice hobo. $45 for Dunia Burke. Am I going too fast? Am I going too fast, guys? Slow my behind down if you feel like. Calm down, Jackie. You're going too fast. Let me give you all time to look at it. All right. So we did the Dooney and the Burke. Number? Nine. Number nine. Another leather coach. How about? Let me take off the price. This was $25 for what I paid. I think I brought this to you guys the last time, but I'm going to bring it again. It's beautiful, Coach. All leather hobo bag. With two dog tags. It's beautiful. Nice for church or wherever you're going. Nice hobo bag. $40 for the coach. Leather coach. Why am I selling this? Oh, let me show you the inside. I didn't show you guys the inside. Hold on. One minute. Though. Inside is clean. We have the coach tag right there this leather is super soft forty dollars for that number ten. number ten guys is the um, Rafi bag that almost looked like an MS. Beautiful Rafi made in Italy. Two handle, or almost look like a mulberry. Pebble grain, light pink. And it says Rafi right there. Show you the inside. Yeah, so a little bit of dirt on the inside that needs to be clean. So, a Rafi bag will be $35. 35 for all leather made in Italy bag. Thought I hit somebody. <laughs> Some kids. Oh, I know. I had... Like, don't be coming in my driveway, mm -hmm. people. Number what? Number nine, 11. Number 11, a Kate Spade. A Katie Spadey. Ha <laughs> ha. I've shown this bag, but you know, I'm gonna reduce the price today. Nice two handle tote, perforated tote, Kate Spade, burgundy, good for fall. Beautiful fall color. With the inside, super cute. $45 for Kate Spade with feet, good condition. 
Number what? 12. Number 12. This beautiful, if I say so myself. Beautiful. Where's my thingy to put it in there? Hold on, guys. Where's my scarf? What's that? Where could that be? All right. I have this scarf to be putting it in the bag so you guys get to see how pretty these bags are. Guys, I'm bringing you nothing but leather bags. Leather. Mm -hmm. Beautiful leather bag. Even the thrift stores have gone crazy with their prices. Sometimes they're in good, you know, they want to sell it, especially American way. Sometimes they're good with their prices and sometimes they're outrageous. Especially with their Dunian books. They be trying to sell them bags for like $130. All right. We got this beautiful. Number 12. Number 12. I love this bag. This is a fossil bag, but with a, somebody, I don't know if this is their initials, it says, or it's part of the fossil brand. It says AGS, but this is fossil. You can put your phone in the side pockets. It's leather, drawstring, you can make it bigger. I love this bag. If you all don't get it, I'm taking it upstairs. It's beautiful fossil. You see that right there? I don't know if you can see it. And this is this big. Gorgeous. With the key hanging. The leather, the handle is still good. Alright. Fossil bag is forty dollars. Number, who's that? No, uh, Miss Bossy, she said, Miss Jackie, I am looking for a black Chanel chain. Thanks. Necklace? Is that what you're saying? Chain belts or necklace? Hi, Sarah, eh? Welcome, girl. Welcome. Welcome, Sarah. I've been calling you Sarah, but it's actually Sarah. So, number what? Number 13. Number, oh, number 12. Patent leather, two handle, all leather, Nostrum's bag, private label. Welcome, girl. Huh? What, Annie? Sorry, I made a mistake. Okay. It was Oh, purse. Oh, with a chain. Okay. I'll keep that in mind. Nostrums made in Italy. Patent leather with a zipper. Nice work. If you're going to work, this is a beautiful work bag. Patent leather with feet from Nostrums. Nostrums. Made in Italy, and this bag is $35, all leather. And it has a zipper, which I'm trying to line up. That's how you close it. Genuine leather, Nostrum's patent leather bag. How much does that say? $30? $35. Mm -hmm. Okay. Because, you know, your girl sometimes. All right, all right, all right. Still bringing you guys this beautiful heavy duty, Dooney and Burke. Number 14. Number what? 14. Number 14. Guys, I, I'm really refraining from keeping bags for myself. It's like every time I say I'm going to keep a bag and then I look around and see all these other bags. I'm like, why Jackie? But I don't own a Dooney and Burke. I don't. So I was going to keep this, but I keep, keep bringing it to you guys because I have not taken it upstairs, which means it's like, uh, Jackie, you can do without. It's a beautiful, 
buffalo leather do you all see this bag do you all see this bag beautiful just a little little scratch here and there but the leather is everything it has two top handle heavy duty crossbody strap it has a snap and it has a million compartments we have that with all these pockets and we have this and it has the Dunian Burke envelope I don't know I guess it's the certification and then we have the red other side and the middle zipper all right enough of this bag this bag is $70 if anybody's interested beautiful gorgeous heavy duty $70 for that Dooney number 15 number 15 we have a rebecca minkoff crossbody you see a little rebecca minkoff crossbody bag a little motorcycle gear with little feet this is like um i mean would you call this black or gray what does it look like to you it kind of look like Looks gray. It looks gray. like a gray bag. Yes, I don't think it's black. I don't know. It could be black. It could be gray. It could be whatever color you want it to be. And we have the zipper. The inside is. Huh, hold on. Let me check out the price tag. That was twenty dollars. The inside is as such. Rebecca Minkov. I've used this bag. I think I've taken this bag to the farmers market before. Yes, crossbody. It's charcoal gray. Yes, it is. You guys, sometimes I'm colorblind. So that's why I need you all. Charcoal gray, Rebecca Minkoff, $35. $35 for beautiful heavy duty chain. Can't get designer for less. Mm -hmm. All right. Number? Number 16. Number 16. It's a Michael Kors tote bag. Beautiful. Michael Kors. You see the right there. Very, very cute, very well made. Got the feet with the Michael Kors all over it. Very classy bag. Very, if I may say so myself, it's not monogram. It's not like, oh, MK, MK. This is a classy Michael Kors bag. With the snap, let me show you the inside. It's two compartments. Yes got that and then we have that yes you still got the price for 40 dollars you have been wondering sometimes like do i even make any money it was that i think it was did i get discount on this one probably 30 percent but beautiful bag this bag is 49 dollars for michael kors Forty-nine. Ouch. Number seventeen. Another Michael Kors. This is a three compartment crossbody. It's more like an accordion bag. Let me put something in here so we get to see what it looks like. Hold on, hold on, people. Okay. Michael Kors crossbody with three zipper compartments. Super cute. And this is $39. 
want to say that. All leather. You can put so much in here. It has all these compartments that you can just, you know where your wallet is, you know where your phone is. You're well organized, you know where your cosmetics are. The inside look like this. There's one compartment. Here's another one. And here's another one. And then we have Michael Kors. And remember, it's an accordion and a crossbody. How much did I say? $39. All right, all right, all right. Oh, Janine said she'll take it. Janine will take a crossbody. Yay! Thank you, Janine. trying to make sure I'm not mixing my sale bags with the regular bags. All right, guys. Number 18. Number 18. We have the Chloe Distress Metallic Patenting Bag. This bag is a Chloe bag, but it's Distress. I was trying to, to um, you know, I've been holding on on this bag until I finally got an authentication before the crossbody. So Michael Kors, Kors, Kors or Sherry Kors. Jennings. Yeah. Okay, what number was that? 16. I think it was a classy bag. Yeah, yeah. how much was it? 49. 49. Thank you, Sherry Jennings, for your Michael Kors. <laughs> Woohoo! Yeah. You got a good one. Okay, what number is this? 18. So, I know somebody has been wanting a Chloe bag. You, I mean, I did get the silver one, but guys, on Fashion File, that bag is selling for 700 So, I know you guys ain't going to take it. So, but I have this one. You see the authentication right there? It took forever to authenticate this bag only because the buckle did not have the Chloe marking. But it is a limited edition. This was... This was designed by Carl Lagerfeld, not um, um, not Phoebe. It was a bunch of them that worked on Chloe, on the Chloe collection. I think the one with Phoebe, I think it was Phoebe Philo, I can't be mistaken, is the one that have the Chloe's on there. But I think this one, Carl Lagerfeld did a couple without the Chloe signature. So this bag is beautiful. It's just, if you're a Chloe girl and you're that, biker chick motorcycle girl that don't really care this buckle is mighty heavy okay it's super heavy and then here's the key but this chloe bag i've been carrying it around even though i finally got an authentication i'm still going to let it go for a whole lot cheaper only because the metallic is peeling on this side but that's what metallic bags do but you can just carry it with pride so i talk too much but this bag is forty dollars haha forty dollars i'm just going on and on it's like damn does she want to sell that bag or what <laughs> <laughs> all right it's like i gotta make you all understand i'm bringing you all some gems up in here so there's that okay Number 19. number 19, another Kate Spade. Where's the, where's my scarf? I've been losing scarves. Oh, here we go. Put it in the bag so you'll get to see it. Okay, you guys saw me when I was buying this bag. And me and some lady had to go at it because she was like, oh, can you fix that? I'm like, uh, yeah, simple. Beautiful, two-handle Kate Spade. This is the problem. She was trying to talk me out of because I know she wanted it. I told her I could burn the little peelings right here. Does not faze me. 
see right here all that could be burned and then it will stop it from peeling i learned this from the filipino guy hadrian is how he shows people how to um if you have a peeling on a bag you could just burn it i never knew that but you know it's good to watch other youtubers see what they're doing but this is a pebble grain but her client, his clientele is of the chain. They'll be buying bags for $3,000. I'll be like, huh? Where you all at? <laughs> On my channel. But anyway, see right here. This, this right here is affordable fashion. It's what we're doing over here. We ain't doing major luxury. So this Kate Spade bag is $30. It's beautiful to handle. Good for church. Let me show you the inside. The inside is really nice like super nice you all see that it says kids paid over here you see the kids paid right there oh you watch him too janine do you see his clientele i'll be like oh okay before i started doing youtube i actually bought it back from him i bought the zach posing that's before my YouTube days. I was like, oh, I want that Zach posing bag, but I sold it to you guys. <laughs> That's the funniest thing. I bought the bag and somebody else bought it from me. I sold it to you guys when I started YouTube. I'm like, Jackie, stop. You don't need no more bags. But anyway, so this is $30. Gorgeous. Beautiful. So that was that Kate Spade. Katie Spadey. That's what we call it. Katie's baby. All right, all right, all right. So, number? 20. Number 20? Mm -hmm. Guys, we are about to cut, bring this down. Okay. This beautiful. Hi, ATL. Yeah, because he be going out there and buying stuff for like 2000 and selling it for 5000 I'll be like, listen, <laughs> that's, to me, this is a hobby. I ain't got that kind of money to go and be buying. What if you don't buy? I'll, mm -mm. I'll be seeing his little Chanel wallets. They be selling for like $1,200. I'll be like, hell to the no. I'm not knocking you, Hadrian. I like you. Trust me, I do. One day I'm going to catch you. We're going to go thrift together. I'm going to go to Orange County. See, I'm giving you a plug on my channel. I'm sending my people to you. But not that you need it. But anyway, we got a Kohan beautiful hobo bag. Gorgeous. You're on a different caliber. You're like way up there. I'm like way down here. Yes, Adrian be selling bags for like thousands be, and people be buying it. I'll be like, who are these people? <laughs> but, you know, hey, good for him. Good for him. See, you're all in California. You all know who he is. He be having live sales, but they be like thousands of dollars. I'll be like, oh my God, you sell one bag. You, you're good for the day. Yes, this call handbag, the inside is a such... So well made, leather trim, and it's woven. The inside is clean. It's by Kohan. And this bag is going to be $35 for all leather Kohan. $35. See now? Shoot. Sure. See how I be giving stuff away? All leather. Number? 21. Number 21. It's another another coach. Our beautiful leather torn lock. You can see that. Two handle. Gorgeous bag. Let me show you the inside. D uh, Triple entrance. Coach bag right here. All leather bag. Gorgeous bag. This coach bag is $49. Very nice. I'll say 40. Yeah, 
beautiful soft coat. Let's see how well made this bag is. Super classy. All right. Anything else anybody want to see back there so we don't sit here all day and be doing some coach bags? I love those. I have four. Four from you, all colors. Who's that? Jeannie. Jeannie? Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. You have, a, yeah. We were used, we could thrift those bags before. They were like very affordable. Now you go to the thrift store, they be pricing them for $59. I'm like, hmm, where am I? Anywho, let me drink some water. We got this um, Cuba patent leather, beautiful Cuba bag. 100% leather with side pockets. Look good with some cargo pants to handle. Yeah. Rock this baby with some cargo pants. How cute is this? Super cute. I got it with my cargo pants on. Love it. It's Cuba. Genuine leather. We have a key, couple of pockets inside, and voila. To handle in very, very good condition. This Cuba bag is $40. What would that be? My trash cans. Forty dollars for the Cuba. Who's that? Who say? Yes, when I finish this one bean, then you guys can ask me for whatever else. We do have sunglasses. Oh, Saint John lover. Before I move on to, I hope you're still in the house. Do you see why you're infused FF? Uh, Fendi two glasses to go with your bag? Let me know because we still have a couple of them. Okay. Number what? 23. Number 23. This beautiful. What is my scarf? Fola bag. Almost look like the Chanel executive bag. But this is Fola. This beautiful. If you know those Chanel SX bag that have that exactly like this, but instead of the ton, it has two CCs. But this is Fuller, which is not a slouch either. Beautiful. Kind of like um, Togo leather. It's more of a Togo leather. Two handle with a ton lock. So even on the lock, it says furlough right there. The inside. You guys, if you know my haul last time I was on office, their furlough bags were running for two something. And those were on sale for two something. Okay. It's right here. It's a furlough bag. Genuine leather. Very nice. Very classy. Classy bag for a classy lady, and this furler bag is 45. We carry it with pride. Beautiful, classy bag, $45. Jean John Lover said, What happened to the FF or the FF on the front glass part? I have those, but I have it in only the black one and the blue. I don't have the brown. So I will show you those if you want to see them. They, if you notice, guys, I created a a, a whole sunglass area. Hmm. Okay. Trying to make it look presentable for you all. Okay, number what? If I close this down and show the glasses. 24. Number 24, we have a Valentino Orlandi bag that we had gotten. Beautiful. Valentino, we had thrifted this from Goodwill with a heavy bow. You can make the bow. You can make this shorter if you want, or you can actually do a crossbody, double crossbody strap. I just don't want to mess up my, <laughs> my ponytail. But here's the back of it. 
to handle inside is as such yes all oh, the glasses right you're right instead of me just leaving them here it was giving me a headache okay i'll show you so the valentino bag is 45 dollars today it used to be more 45 for valentino online see i'll show you that in a minute as soon as i'm i got a couple of huh st john lover said yes I know, I said I'll show her when I'm, when I'm finished putting this. I have three more bags and then I'll show you. Okay. Number what? 25. Number 25. Vintage Kate Spade. Teeny tiny silhouettes. Good for church or going out. Nice parachute fabric. This bag has been here for Lord knows how long. It's one of my OGs. When I started... When I started selling on YouTube, I had found this bag. Why it's still here, I don't know. Because this bag is super, 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 super cute. Just cute, period. Very classy. Vintage, though. You can tell how vintage it is. Look at the zipper. It's old. Said I black. It's really teeny tiny, Jeanine. It's like this big, but I'll show you. So this right here is... $30 today for Kate Spade. For Katie Spade. $30. Number what? I'm, at, I'm, I'm about to be done, guys, with the bags. Number 26 for the next one. Another crossbody, soft, beautiful leather. Another Kate Spade. But, guys, the tone lock has peelings right here, but who cares? Super cute. I mean, if you care, let me know. Don't say who cares. They wanted $35 at the thrift store on, on not a sale day. That's how much you will pay. So that's how much I'm going to sell it to you for, $35. So I can at least get my money back. Super cute. Quilted in the front. And crossbody. $35, number what? 26 Number 26 for that Kate Spade bag. All right. And if I show you the bag, Jimmy, let me uh, let me go get your bag before I do my last of the last. Do you still want it? It's really like a little mini, a mini tiny bag. Oh, what's this? It's super teeny tiny. Came out good well. Let me see how much I paid for this. Tag still attached. <laughs> Ouch. Did I just tear it up? No, I did. It was $19. I forgot to show you guys. On the inside, right there. $30. You want it? Super cute. Wait. Wait, wait. More than thirty dollars. Thirty-five dollars. Ah. Thirty-five dollars. Oh my God. Wait, Jenny. Hold up. Hold up. Eh, I got. I gotta see. It has a code. You know, I just got this bag. I haven't authenticated it yet, but that's okay. Thirty-five dollars. Do you want it? It has a little code in there. Like sometimes I don't look at stuff. I just bring it to you all. You want it? Yeah. Yeah? Huh? I said Miss Bossy was late. Oh, sorry, Miss Bossy. It's been hiding back there on that table. I've been trying to tell you. I need to be quick on that table now. That table is where it's at. That's my hiding spot. Oh, shooks. It's, um, what's her name here? Pam Green. Are you here? I have a bag. If you're in the house, let me know, Pam Green. If not, I'm about to bring it to the live. It's a Tory Birch. You asked me for a Tory bag. A Tory Birch bag. 
and they start putting stuff away. And then I'll show. I'm gonna show the glass. I'm gonna show your glasses. Um, I'm gonna show your glasses. Um, I saw it when you bent down. <laughs> I thought you saw it way earlier. You only saw it when I bent down. If I was you all, when I walk in here, you should scan that account. You should be scanning that table. I thought that's where you saw um, St. John's bag. Because that's where I had put it way back there. Because I know I had to show it to her. Alright, let me show you the, the glasses. Oh, is Pam Green in the house? I got a bag for her. Is she there? Is she not? Number? 28. Uh, Janine said I went to Tori if she's not here to get it. Okay. Do you even know what it look like, Janine? <laughs> it's a big bag. Yeah? You guys remember this bag. I had to work on it. But I think now I have enough to bush to last me a lifetime. So she she asked me if I have a Tori. I told her she could wait. But if she's not here... This is the bag. You guys have seen me use this bag before. But I was going through my stuff. I was like, oh my God, another Tory Burch. You know, we have that. We have this. So, we have that. <laughs> So, but anyway, the Terry is $49. If she's not here, then Janine is yours. Or if she don't clock it. I didn't see her coming. Genuine Terry Birch. I have... The other one I got from Nordstrom's, another tote is like, how many Tory Bush totes can one person have? Beautiful. Okay, we're gonna give her time. Palm Green, if you're in the house, let me know. Let me show St. John her sunglasses. Hold on, people. I just don't want so much stuff in my face. Oh, there was another bag I was going to show. But anywho. You want to see the black or the blue? Both? Actually, you know what? Let me bring you guys close to the sunglass case. Oh, cool. Let me, can we, are we going to be able to, mm -hmm. to take it down? Hold on, people. Can you help me? Get the cord, so where's mm -hmm. the cord? Hold on, people. Sorry. Sorry. You know, take those things so it doesn't cut off the lights. Because I want to take it up front. All right, so this is as close as we're going to get, I think. I just want to show you guys. So here we are. I'm going to bring the glasses to you. And then you can see. All right. So. This is the one. This is the black one. And here's the blue. This is for St. John Lover if she's still around. This is what the black looks like. It actually goes with what I'm wearing. But the blue brightens up everything. Here's the blue. So, do you see St. John Lover? This is the blue and this is the black.
What she say? Take both. Oh, you take both? Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. Let me um let me find the one that's already in the plastic. Oh, and then there's one more. And then there is the red one, like fire red. This one just makes everything look so bright. I don't know if you can see it. So let me give you a um let me give you a bell. Yes, you did get all the colors, Janine. You sure did. So two, the blue, Saint John, the black for Saint John. I think they were twenty-four. I think that's what they were. She said, thank you. How much do you have the red? Yeah, I have the red. Is that, the red is the last one. I think I gave you a price. They were like 24. Was it, Janine, was it 24 or 22? I forgot. Here's the red, mighty bright. I don't know what, Janine. So we got those. What time is it right now? 3.25. Oh, okay. So we got that. What she said? Yes, on red too. Okay. Okay. Thank you, Jenny. Thank you, Saint John Lover. <laughs> so we did get that turtle shell once, without the infused, just turtle shell, heavy duty. Super cute. So we just like in a sunglass mood. Now that I have my sunglasses here, I'm like, ah. What'd she say? She said, okay, Janine, we got them in color. <laughs> and this is the one with the infused uh, CCs is on the inside. You really, it's hard to see it on the, uh, I don't know if you could see it. You all see the FFs right there, upside down. I mean, uh, my fingers right there. Do you see the little FFs? Super cute. Mm-hmm. So we got that. Miss Bossy says she wants a chin, a Chanel, whatever. So I got three of those FF ones. For the upside down CCs. What did Jenny say? That matches the bag. Oh yeah, oh yeah. It does, doesn't it? St. John Lover, the other one matches your bag. Yes, it does. Who's that? How much is Sassy Nola? Cream bag, Lemishka. Yeah. Which one? This the small one or the big one? I'll show you. But anyway, let me show you all the upside down, Cece. I'll show you. Uh, who was that? Miss Bo? Sassy Nola. Oh, Sassy Nola. Sassy, hold on. The small or the big? I'll show you both. Okay. So I just did retail price. What she say? The big or the big, big one? Mm -hmm. Okay, let me make you a price. So just the retail price for this was one sixty eight, but I will give it to you for forty dollars for the big one only because it's been here for a minute, and thirty five for the small one. And this so it has a crossbody. So just the retail price one twenty nine. Now, may I please have the shirt you have on? 
I have to go see if she has another one. I will definitely let you know when I do a haul tomorrow. I'll probably go see her later on. She's not too far from me. You should get those infused glasses to go with your bag. The FF ones on the inside. That, those are cute. But anyway, Sassy. How much did I say the big one was? 40. Mm -hmm. And the small one, 35 for the Bagley Mishka. And it does have a crossbody strap. Did, did you get that, Sassy Nola? Okay. Let me give you all some. Justin Wu. I still have. Who's that? That one is Sassy Nola. I'll what did take... she say? Oh. No, she said I'll take the big one. I can see it inside. Oh, you want to see the inside? Hold on. Let me show you the inside. Hold on. It has a crossbody strap, adjustable. And the inside is, this is brand new. The inside has the Bagley Mishka zipper pocket and then it has a media pocket and we have this if you need if you need it which i don't know why but it's there you see the inside sir and then it has feet on the bottom do you see the inside sassy and your zipper has the um the mb the bagley mishka on there I love these bags. Super cute. Very well made. Do you see it, Sassy? I showed you the inside. What was that? Oh, it's my ring light. Oh my God, it looked like some strange thing just coming through. Let me show uh, Miss Bossy this bag. It's not Chanel, but it's a beautiful. Miss Bossy, you take it? Okay. Thank you, Sassy. The first no, of sunglasses. Which one? The, I think it's the... I know the FF with the, the... This one? With a tan? Did she say this one? Yeah. She um, said, and one? how much are the tan and white sunglasses? This one? They're 24. Deanna? This is the one, 24. Was there another glasses you were asking me for or was just that? Because the first ones we showed were the Fendi. Because the first ones were the, the one St. John. But, but I don't know if I have, I might have another one. I think I have a black one upstairs. I don't know if you still want those. But this is the one you want so let me give you a bell which other one are you talking about the ones before the imp oh i think the turtle shell ones before oh the, the turtle shell. shell the turtle yeah. shell hold on this one's I like this because you can wear them indoors. Deanna, this one's right. Mm -hmm. The shades of these are not so dark like the infused ones. So, do you want both? The tan one and the tortoise shell? We already gave her a bell for this. So, did you want this one? Let me know. Because that's the one that came before the... Yeah, that was the one that came before the... Uh... And Janine, uh, sorry, St. John Lover said, uh, show me which glasses you are talking about that match my purse. They infused. This one. Let me show you your purse. Put them together. Maybe that's the end I said. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is oh 
I got lint everywhere. This one I was saying because the FFs are all the way inside. See that? And then, you know, you have this bag. I, I mean, that's just me. I could be, it just depends. I wear mine with my bags, with my Fendi bags. This is the one I was talking about. You see it? I was gonna show you this box or something. Okay, enough of that. Enough of that, enough of that. Oh, my sunglass case is getting mighty empty. I need to, what she say? Yeah. So I showed you, Deanna, was that, did you confirm on the tortoiseshell one? Yeah, she said I want the tortoiseshell one, not the white ones. Oh, you want the tortoiseshell one. Okay. Sorry. So this one, not that one. Okay, just one, Renny. Really. Okay. Switch it to the tortoiseshell. So that's the one then. Anybody want to see any clothing? Any clothing today? You're welcome, girl. We're not doing clothing today. Miss Bossy, I have this heavy-duty bag. I mean, it's not Chanel, but it looks like a 19. I will take the white FF for St. John Lover. The white FF? The sunglasses. Which one? The one Deanna did not get? Yeah. She okay. said she'll take it then. So you want the white one instead? Okay. I mean, with that. Not the infused one. She did not want all the infused. This one. You want this one, St. John? Not the brown. Thank you, St. John lover. Okay, put St. John for the infused right, one. What did I do with her glasses? The other ones that she got. The tortoise show. No, the FFs. Oh, they are over here in front of my face. Mm -hmm. I was showing Miss Bossy a beautiful chain bag. Yeah. Hi, Style Maybe. Welcome. We're almost done, but welcome. Miss Bossy, I have this beautiful bag here. I don't have a Chanel, but shush. This is close to a Chanel as you can get. This is from, I actually got this at TJ Maxx, believe you me. It still has the price. How much did I pay for this thing? Yo, $30. It's MMS. Very heavy duty chain. If you want it, you can have it for $35 until I can find you something. That's all we got. Oh, this is, um, this is um, Sassy's bag. Let me put it on the side of the sale. All right, guys, I was showing you two more bags and I said I was showing this beautiful Jason Wu bag, semi lottery. You guys know Jason Wu is not a I have too many of Jason Wood totes. So I'm bringing you all this one. I have bought this for myself. But then I looked in my room. I was like, what's all this Jason Wood you got going? Yeah, I feel better style, maybe. Mm -hmm. So we have this Jason Wood bag here. If anybody wants it, it's $50. The crossbody, very luxury. Jason Wood. Hello. Who's that? Hmm. Beautiful tote. That's just June. And we have this Chanel esque look alike tote bag. Beautiful quilted bag, brand new from Airless Showroom. Vegan leather. By Classic Fashions, they have the chains here. 
we have that there. Then we have a middle zipper, good for work. What she said? She said, Jimmy, can I please get the Louis Vuitton bag, please and thank you. <laughs> <laughs> nice bit to you too. All right, this beautiful bag here is thirty-five dollars. Nice work tote. She said, "Oh, sorry, I went." Oh, that's nice. Yeah, that's Miss Bossy, just you know, I'm out there thrifting. If I find something, I will bring it to you. So don't worry. The holidays are coming. I'm sure we'll find some. I gotta go to the other part of town. I haven't been to the other part of town lately. Oh, yeah, master put this here. I have a sore throat. What time is it? 3.39. 3.39, my body shut it down. A cute little animal print. I want to see the Valentino the jacket dress. That you showed a few days ago. Oh, the... Okay, the one I wore. Okay, I'll show you. This cute little embossed snake skin. Kind of like a MS. Jason Wu, how much? How much was Jason Wu, Remy? 50. I'll say 49 is what I paid. I'm actually giving you what I paid for. $49. What your girl had paid at freaking, where did I buy that bag? I think at Ross or so. Jesse Wu, that's the price I pay you. That's how much I'm gonna let it go for. I'm not making any money off of that. Only because I have so many. So $49. Oh, what did somebody ask me? I forgot. Somebody asked me for something. The Valentino Oh, the Valentino jacket. jacket. Yeah. See if Cher wants the uh, Jesse Wu. Let me know. $49 worth 289 Yes. Yeah? All right, I'm coming. Hold on. I'm going to my Valentino. Go eat bye bye. So yes, for the Jason Wu, for the Cheryl Jennings. Yeah. Let me give her a bell. Where's my Jason Wu? Okay. Second Jason Wu of Souls. Yay! Thank you, Cheryl Jennings, for the Jason Wu. Okay. All right. You want to see? Who is it? Judy Edwards. You wanted to see the Valentino double breasted? Black. I don't know what size this is, but I could try it on for you. Made in Italy. Made in Italy. Right here. Trying to find the, the size. It says right there. Made in Italy. Double breasted, it has all the buttons. What she say? Will somebody say something? Mm. Hmm? No, they were just saying how cute this snake skin bag was. Oh, yeah, that snake skin bag is cute. How much did Someone I say it was? Uh, you didn't say. What's the question, Sassy? She said, is that cream quilted bag a bagly? How much? Which one? I think she meant the Chanel. The, the, the tote I sent you? The first tote? It's not a bagly. But I have baglies. If you want a bagly. This is a quilted bagly Mishka. Super cute with the heavy chains. The one I showed you was just a fashion bag from LA Showroom. But the only bagly quilted I have is smaller bags. 
But I have a big green tote. A Baglimishka tote. A big green one. If you want to see, it's way up there. But anyway, I was trying this on. I need a green belt. Do you have one? Yeah. Yes, I do. I always do. I think I have a CD green one. So, Judy Edwards, here's the Valentino. Double breasted, if you want it, it's 45. Actually, 40. 40 for the Valentino blazer. Let me see the green belt. So. And if you want to see that belt, Sassy, let me know. I mean, that bag. Oh, shoot. Oh, stop the madness. You guys, when I kicked the, the thingy. I'm coming. I'm coming. Stay, stay. Anything anybody say? Guys, I kicked the rug. What's that? What's Sassy? Did she give a belt to which one? Cream quilted. Uh, Jean gave a belt to Sassy. For what? For which one, Sassy? What are we giving a belt a belt for? I didn't know I think which she one she wants got. The cream bag. I don't know if she does or not. You didn't see it on the thingy? Which one, Janine? What did Sassy get? I missed it. I was busy kicking the, the cord. Finally, let me, let me get the belts for St. John. Let me don't worry about Simba. Mm -hmm. Judith Edwards said I will take it. What was she taking? I forgot. The cream bag, the one that you just talked about. The Bagley Mishka bag. I don't have no cream Bagley Mishka. I have the white one. I don't know. You said it was a Chanel esque quilted. Oh, the Chanel esque yeah. quilted. Okay, it's not Bagley Mishka. Alright, hold on. Who wants that? Who wants that? Uh, Judith Edwards. Judith Edwards? But before Sassy, gave, Jenny gave a belt to Sassy. And she oh, which one? It. The same bag. Did the... Sassy want it? I didn't, that's the thing I was asking yeah. you, Lily. Really. I know she... my thing fell off. She didn't say. She didn't say. Okay. Sassy didn't say. Sassy didn't say. See who wants it. I'm trying to find the, the, the belt. Where's my, where my belts? Sassy Nola said the big cream bag I got isn't it Bagley Mishka? No, it's not. So bad. Um, no, it's not Bagley Mishka. The big one she got is Bagley Mishka. You know, the top, the one she yeah, bought before. Yeah, the one she's talking about. Yeah, it's Bagley Mishka. Sassy, your bag was Bagley Mishka. The one I showed you the inside, it was Bagley Mishka. And then you say, um, so Jenny wants this, this one? Yeah. Okay. How much was this again? 35. 35. So this went to Cheryl Jennings. And your oh, other... Judith Edwards said the jacket for me. Okay. Okay. This went to Cheryl Jennings. Yes, I see. Your other bag was Bagley Mishka. So this, to, let me get the... Um, Jacket. Huh? Oh, okay. Thank you. What did I say? 45 or yeah, 40? 40. 40? Valentino? Mm-hmm. Okay. All right. Valentino blazer for Judy Edwards. Woohoo! <laughs> we saw the men's blazer today. That's what I'm talking about. All right. I was showing St. John said she wanted a belt. Mm -hmm. Okay. St. John, what I see, I have a, a green CD belt, but I don't know where it's at. I have the uh, Medusa head Versace green stretchy. I know you wanted a green belt. It's a stretchy band. So I have that. That is $35. Damn.
Hannah asked Jackie what happened to Thomas James' sunglasses. He haven't picked up any recently. They just now, they didn't have it before. They just now replenished. I saw it on Saturday. I will fix them. They look like they brought the same thing over and over. Yeah, let me show you. I will, do, I will fix them for you. I want to show St. John this green belt. Okay, we have the CD green belt. This is $40. What is the quilter cream, cream bag, bag with tin on the table? table? That small one, it's not cream, it's more like a blush pink. I have two sizes, but I will show you. St. John Lover, we have the CD green belts. If you're interested, it's $40. Let me finish this. She Please. said, okay, yes, the CD. Who? St. John Lover. Okay, she wants the CD. Yay, that was fast. Thank you. St. John Lover for your CD belts. I don't know who who asked this question. It was Sassy. No. Sassy again. Sassy. This one is Bagley Mishka with a chain on the left table. Oh, that Chanel ask. Hold on, hold on. I need to replenish that bag. That bag sold last year during the holidays like wildfire. This bag. This is a, a maxi Chanel-esque parachute. Do you have any more of the beaded bracelets? Beaded bracelets, which ones? So here we go. Who was that that asked me that question? Beaded bracelets, okay. Here we go. With the chain, this is, we had this in black last year, and then this is the last one. This one was $40, the black was 45 This is the last one we got. This is a good, good, good sale. Show you the inside. Looks as such, it's like a, a Chanel Maxi quilt. Beautiful bag, you can wear it in all weather. So, yeah, this is my last one in the house. I hope they still have it. I have to go to the market. Because I know this was a very good sale. Okay, beaded bracelet. Which one? Beaded bracelet. Janine says, um, sorry, Jackie, I have to get ready. My kids are treating me out to dinner. Okay. Well, I'm about to close. Thank you. Mm -hmm. We're closing. Thank you, Janine. Yeah. Yeah. We're closing anyway. This is like, I'm just answering questions right now. And Sassy said I prefer leather. Hmm? Sassy Nola said I prefer leather. Oh, you prefer leather. Yeah. Yeah, no, that's a parachute. So, if I get a leather, I'll let you know. So, guys, the last but not the least is a Trina Turk little, little bag. Who says Trina? Yes, enjoy yourself, Jeannie. Bon appetit. Have a wonderful dinner. And this bag, this Trina Turk little tote is $30. It has a little wallet thing on the inside. It's more like a full leather, but it's, it's a brand name. It's Trina by Trina Turk. So just their retail price, $98. Over here is $30. So that's it. Alright guys, it's been a very fruitful day. We usually end at, we're supposed to end at 3.30 because Remy's giving me like the evil eye because I'm like taking too long. He's like, girl. It's do, 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 do. <laughs> yes, you do. Uh-oh, uh that's my jacket. It just dropped. Alright guys, so... 
Ocha. You guys know how to email me in case there's anything else you want. I am going to yeah. go ahead and close this live sale. And all form of payments are in the description. Yes, and all form of payments are in the description box. If you have any questions, please email more. That is me for French. So that's that. My dogs are giving me the look. They're sitting in the hallway like, why are you out there? Are we in here? <laughs> so that's that, guys. It was a fruitful day. I'm like taking bags away because I don't want to step in bags. I'm about to close this, guys. So we shall see another time. Good night, everyone. It was fun, I think. It was fun. And if you're new here, please come back. Subscribe. We get affordable fashions here. I'm not trying to break the bank with you guys, okay? We're just trying to make our sisters look beautiful. That's what we're doing. Said it was a great train. It was a great train. It really was. Thank you, guys. I appreciate it. Oh, um, okay. Oh, never mind. I'm just dropping stuff everywhere. So, guys, let me close this sale. I'm just, like, stepping on stuff, and you were like, what the hell is she doing? She's trying to close. Good night, everybody, and thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate you guys. You guys are the best. Thank you. Thank you, Miss Bossy. Thank you, Sassy. I know you will. Thank you. So, we're back to say bye-bye. I'll see you all tomorrow at the other side, which means the other channel. So, stop by to see my little vlog that I always post on Sundays. So, yeah. For some reason, this channel <laughs> is, is kicking ass. My regular channel is like, hell... I'm like, wait a minute now. I just monetize this channel, but people are subscribing. So I appreciate you all. I thank you. I thank you. But please subscribe to my other channel too. That's my main home channel. But I can see why you guys come here. Thank you, Diana. Thank you so much. Appreciate you. Email me if you have any questions, which you always do. So guys, it's been real. We're going we're gonna to end the sale. Kisses. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Good night, everybody. Please, good night. Oh, Van Cleef. Did you want some? Okay, now I know. See? You guys got to request these things. I'll get you some. You want Van Cleef bracelet? You want the black or any color? Because, you know, they become in different colors, too. But the black and the white or the pearl color, the white color, which one you want? I might have. I think <laughs> I might have a black one. Oh, I think I have a, a white and a pearl color. See, I haven't even been bringing you guys jewelry. I have jewelry coming wazoo. But let me know if you want the Van Cleves. And I will send you uh, a picture. All right, guys. It's like there's a stupid fly in my garage that keeps buzzing in my ear because I have both doors open. So, anyway, guys, it's been real. We got to go. Email me if you have any questions, guys. Thank you for stopping by. Please like, hit the like button as you walk out the door. If you did not like it when you came in, smash that like button. Say, shoo, I love this girl. Okay, right, cool. because <laughs> I love you. Well, you gotta love me back. All right, guys. I'll see you all later. Bye. Good night, all things, Liz. I hate cutting people off. No, oh, you're welcome. Thank you.
Oh, how do I do this? Oh, it's the X, right? Mm -hmm. All right, people. I'm about to sign out. We'll check. What did she say? We'll check the replay. Okay, you do that. Bye.